Yes, I'm at work hiding in a corner with my hoodie up because it's cold. It's my last day. I am moving to Tennessee. What you just saw was what I've been doing for the past six and a half years of my life. Six and a half years of blood, sweat, and maybe some tears. Yes, there's been tears. Sometimes it hurts. Sometimes this job sucks. Sometimes it does, but other times it's really good, cool, and fun. But it's time to move on. Time to move on to something else. Ignore all the noises in the background, like the phone ringing. Um, we're still open. We're currently working right now. So I'm going to have to wrap this up real quick. i got to go home pack, but I will see you guys on the road. Just packing all of, all of my necessities. Just the bare bare necessities to get by just the bare necessities um i got that i got this stuff right here all this stuff you know just the bare necessities okay it's actually just some of that stuff not all that no that's not all mine a little bit more than just the bare necessities gotta take my instruments i'm taking this bessie right here it's gonna be my main one all the other stuff is gonna have to stay for now i'll probably get those later i got all my fishing stuff got everything my vlogging stuff probably the thing i have the most is socks gotta have plenty of socks next thing um i've got a lot of pillows pillows and blankets those are my necessities to survive and i definitely cannot forget one of the most important things my monkeys uh the other one's in the car but yeah this one's come with me in the truck gotta have a monkey on your trip or whatever animal you prefer i would call them spirit animals but i really don't know if it's a monkey is my spirit animal or not anyway now i'm just babbling on and on so um you didn't see that. Random fact, it's currently 8 o'clock and I am just leaving. It's great. It's dark. It's wonderful. But I almost forgot my financial advisor. Yes, that's kind of a quote from a movie. Somebody, anybody, whoever knows which movie has a crab in it that is begging the main character to become his financial advisor. Which movie has that in it? Let me know in the comments, see if you know what it is. Yes, it is a cartoon movie, and it's one of my favorites. Uh, but for now, I've got a long drive ahead, and I'm going to rock it out. Let's go. Hey, so we made it. I made it actually at like seven o'clock this morning, and I decided not to start my video then. Um, we have some nice, nice ducks in the background. They're great. Hopefully they're not too noisy, but I've had ducks in the family before. A bunch of us guys are hopping in that thing and we're gonna go to a volleyball tournament tomorrow. It's gonna be sweet. So I have to unpack all my stuff real quick and then repack. Um, mainly just grab everything out of this truck and throw it in there. So I'm gonna do that real quick. And I'll see you guys when we load, when we load that thing up with a bunch of more junk and people. What's up guys? This is a free tourney vlog. Jordan, We're hanging out in the hotel. Coach this, this is the shirt. Hey, Jordan, this is hey, the shirt right yeah. there. This is the bracket. Since, since I'm in charge, it's going to put us a bye right to here. Finals. Is that even fair? Probably not, but we don't play fair. So, yeah, that's with this winged Joe. Go find him on YouTube. Subscribe. Subscribe to his channel. He's playing Call of Duty, which is in Wiggle. No. This is Pajin. He is a I fruit. like the way you're using he's, this. Song. He's, he's, a, he's a fruit from Peru. <laughs> so, just figured I'd get you a live look in. Right, let me my uh, Can I call you Mr. Fuzzy Fruit? And we're getting ready for tomorrow. Get the brackets for oh, no, It's going to be a good day, hopefully. Hopefully, no one get hurt or anything like that. Because we're going to play. Yeah, we're going to play about that. Yeah, okay, so. Hey, we're going to try a different game, though. Yeah, all right. Yeah, we'll how see about you all. Need <laughs> we'll see you all tomorrow. Bright and early.
So we were to. I haven't even accidentally tasted pure crap. He's still. He got to beat that out. Right, uh, we went to a volleyball tournament and we're on the way back, and we lost. We came like fourth. So I'm not gonna post a little bit anything about it because we didn't win. So you're not gonna you're not gonna see anything. We we'll just have to wait for the next one. And yeah, this now, this is us and our adventures. Now, in addition to losing the volleyball tournament, we've also lost our little sibling. <laughs> we are yeah, we we'll <laughs> seventy miles down the road somewhere. Uh, the other kids in the other vehicle are currently lost somewhere. So yeah, that's great. Which the bad thing is, the oldest one is like seventeen. So so, so they're not even actually better. kids. They're actually like minors. All of them. So yeah, well, well, yeah. Might get in trouble. We never know. So oh, like these yeah. morons here, <laughs> exactly, decided to dump coffee in this beastie, and now we're at a gas station and they're cleaning it. We're cleaning it. It's actually a really brilliant idea. It's it's, really it's ridiculous. That was probably gonna stink like something else. What do you guys have to say for yourselves? Well, I think yeah. he spilled the coffee. Yeah, I mean, look at this. I mean, we're, yeah. Um, I mean, there's not much to do. There's not know, much you can use at a gas station. When tragedy mean. strikes and you drink, and you, <laughs> you got to do, you got to survive. A place, but you have to learn to adapt with your survive. research. I mean, look at that. That is, that's crystal clean right there. That is that spotless. spotless. I could, I would eat off of that right now. I would. Ew. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> Jailhouse rock, rock. That's rock, that's rock. Oh my goodness. It's like one o'clock in the morning. So we just got back. We had some unexpected turn of events. So we're gonna go to bed and I'll see you guys 